My name is Dr. Harvey Brown. I'm an internist and I specialize in pulmonology and critical care. I'm the principal investigator for a study that was just completed on the Everon device. It's important to constantly measure heart and respiratory rate as well as movement and turns. The reason for that is that heart and respiratory rate are some of the earliest indicators of potential problems that patients are having. And it's known that changes in these parameters can precede a full-blown crisis. So that a patient who has an abnormal heart rate or respiratory rate needs to be evaluated immediately by the nurses. And this is accomplished by the system causing an alert, which uh, then causes the nurse to come to the bedside. In terms of movement, we know that things like pain and agitation can cause excessive movement. Again, the nurses would be alerted to this phenomena and do an evaluation at the bedside. And finally, turns become very important in the prevention of pressure sores and the ability of the system to remind the nursing staff of their need to turn the patients has been very valuable. The Everon unit is an important device in the hospital because for the majority of patients, no monitoring is done except for those that are in the intensive care unit or telemetry. The Everon device provides us with the opportunity to monitor patients in a non-ICU, non-telemetry setting. The advantage of having Everon in place is that it provides an extension of the nurse's care Normally, nurses on a medical surgical floor would only see a patient for vital signs every four hours. The Everon device provides us with the opportunity for the nurses to get continuous patient data even when they're not actually in the room. My experience with the Everon system has been very positive. I found that it's helped me monitor my patients better, and overall, I think it's improved the quality of patient care. The parameters that the Everon unit measures include heart rate, respiratory rate, bed exits, movement, and turns. All of these parameters are measured using a very sensitive motion detector, which is transmitted using a sensor that's placed under the mattress. Another important feature of the system is the ability to record and validate the turns that the patients are accomplishing either on their own or with the nursing staff so that there is the ability to go back and document the number of turns that the patient has had and make sure that everything is being done in a timely fashion. One of the really nice features of the Everon unit is the ability to show trends in key parameters, specifically heart rate and respiratory rate. These trend plots can be accessed very easily with the bedside unit, and they're available to both nurses and doctors. In this way, a nurse can look back at a trend in either heart rate or respiratory rate, and this helps them in determining whether that parameter has changed significantly and whether to notify the physician. Similarly, physicians can look back and see whether there's a trend that shows the patient is deteriorating in some way and requires some additional medical intervention.